and welcome to a brand new Let's Play. Whoa, all the collars. Uh, all the collars. Okay, okay. All the collars that you can have on the screen at one time. Which is not many. Not for this game. No. So, this game was made by, like, all of the Sierra, like, gods here of the era, pre Corian Glory Pole. Um, Chris Iden been around, so. Hey, this Whoa. looks kind of like. King's Quest. Yes. So, considering it's based exactly off that engine, where is my... I can't find the remote to turn down slow speed, fast speed. The sound. Fast speed! But, I mean, there isn't a lot of sound in it. <clears throat> so, if you know anything at all about the Black Cauldron, uh, you know, it was created by Disney, and it was a pretty abysmal failure, and about killed... The Disney animation studio. And that's because studio. they were trying to reach a more mature audience, but that wasn't what the Disney brand was. Right. Like, the movie itself is a good movie. Yeah. It's just, it just didn't do well because it's not what people expect. Actually, what's amazing is, if you know the movie, this looks like the movie. It's just, you know, pixelated. Tired, it's time for you to feed our favorite pig hidden wind, says old Dalvin. Take good care of her. Oh, it's over. <laughs> I'm not going to worry too much about... You need to get the porridge. Yes, because Henwin's gruel is warming over the fire. You carefully reach over the fire and take Henwin's pot of simmering gruel. So an interesting thing about this game is there is no parser system for this era. Um, you would use the function key. So F3 would let you choose an item. F4 would use it. F6 would perform use near the character's location. And F8 would look. Awesome. Uh. <laughs> on the goat in the background. This is just like the movie. <laughs> there is nothing to do here. <laughs> Get out of my way, fucker! You open the gate and notice it has fallen off its hinges. You'll have to fix that someday, but not today. Hi, goat! That lets the pig run away. Hi, Henwin. You are my favorite pig. You're my only pig, but you're my favorite. It's like Henwick's... So, another thing about this game... There, there are different endings. There are multiple ways to end the game based on how the cauldron's destroyed. Oh, look, the piggy's eating. Henwin certainly enjoys eating. Uh-oh. Oh, Henwin is trotting away. I knew it. Perhaps she's going to Dalbin's cottage. I don't know about that. You do too, no. You know this movie. No, I know, she runs away and he has to go get her. Yes, because the pig farmer becomes the hero. But first, we see like some type of foretelling of the future using Henwin's magical powers. Yep, into the bowl. Yes. Look, something's wrong with Henwin. What? What's wrong with Henwin? As Henwin places her snout in the water, she enters a trance. A vision appears above the bowl. It's not above the bowl. It's supposed to be in the bowl. Well, they have to do that for I this. Know. Hey, that's the Horn King. It is the Horn King, and he is going to bitch slap us dead. He was kind of a meh villain. I think that's kind really? of another thing. I think thing. he's one of the creepiest villains. Terran, says Dalvin, you never know about Henwin's magic powers. Uh, Henwin can show us things that happened in faraway places. Through her vision, she is now telling me a terrible tale. Why did that one stay longer? The Horned King, the most evil role in all of Triton, is searching for Henwin. He can force her to use her visions to reveal the location of the Great Black Cauldron. If he finds the Black Cauldron, he will have unspeakable power. Turn, you must take Henwin to the hidden cottage of the Fair Folk. There are only hope to keep her from the Horned King. I think it's Prydain is the... Is it? The, the, like, if I remember the way they pronounced it from the... Good luck, movie. Turn. Take this coil of rope and hurry before the Horned King's power becomes unstoppable. Now, what's cool is, like, this is apparently based off a book series... And they they could have done like a whole series of these. So now we have a knapsack. We have an apple. It looks delicious, sacrilegious. Ooh, this bread. looks uh. like enough bread for three meals. The water flask. So yes, we have to eat in this game, or you will die. That's cool. If you don't have, and if you don't have specific things, and you have to eat, and you eat the wrong thing, you can't beat the game. And you can also die of thirst. So we got a drink. Yeah, you gotta get your water flask. Oh, and you have to fill it. Oh, yep, my. you fill your water flask with water because that's what we fill it with, not vodka. Why don't we take a goose with this? But this actually beat the Maniac Mansion like multi-ending type adventure game by a oh. whole year. 
We get nice That's sound cool. effects because we're using the Apple II. And some, like, animation. There's a hole in the tree. You discover a musical lute inside a hole in this tree. You can always take the lute and run. <laughs> <laughs> I bet Allo did that. You take the lute and realize it's... I think it was out of tune. Is that what it said? Something like that. Oh, no! It's one of the... Okay. Okay, cool. Okay, this is when the pig up the game. Well, see, one of the things in this game is... If you can keep Henwin from getting kidnapped... Uh -huh. You don't have to go to the castle and do specific things. Because you have to go rescue Henwin if she gets captured. So there's many different things that you oh, can do. so you can avoid that whole part of the storyline. Yes. And we have some maze of trees. This confused the crap out of me when I played this game the first time on the other channel. <clears throat> Getting through this part, I was like, okay. That is annoying because it doesn't look like you should be able to get through it. Right. I like the big old smile on the pig. It's like, Nur. Derp a derp. Yeah, and there's like a because the fairy folk, I do believe, are supposed to be in the trees there. I think, or the fair folk. We I have guess, to, in this yeah, one. we have to wait till they pop in or something. <laughs> there I am. Hey, <laughs> uh oh, hen went stuck. Because it's using the same um, awful guiding that they used in King's Quest One for the goat. So it's like, ugh, there oh. it is. You emerge from the brambles into a clearing with a strange underground house. Hoss. If you can read this quickly. You open you the door, peek inside, and carefully enter the underground house. <clears throat> Henwin recognizes Gris Gristel as uh, one of the fair folk, and long ago visitor of... I don't know those words. <laughs> <laughs> what are words? Welcome, Tarwin, says the fairy. I am Gristel, one of the fair folk, and friend of Dalvin. I, he told us, blah, 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 blah. Congratulations, you <laughs> delivered him and safely and successfully fulfilling that. But since you left, um, the Horn King behaves even more fiendishly. My king contacted Dalvin, <laughs> seeking... <laughs> since the fair folk are continually moving, I can't tell you where they are, but I can tell you that the next magic password is that <laughs> word. And good luck. Terran. Gristel. Gwistel. It's like crystal. It's Gwistel, I would say. Come, Henwin. I'll keep you safe from the Horned King. I about said the Horned Frog. Henwin smiles goodbye as Gwistel takes her through his secret passage. Uh oh So, yeah, we've been playing the game for, like, how long? We have 29 points already. So. <laughs> you carefully open the cupboard. Time to steal from people. It's not nailed down. We now have oh, cookies. Elves make cookies. Mm, Keebler elves, it's sacrilegious. Since the cupboard is bare, you close it. Because mm -hmm. we're nice like that. This is like so. King's Quest. And Leisure Suit Larry, like the original Leisure Suit Larry graphics. You close the door. Because it's beneficial to do that. It is respectful to close the door. The maze would annoy me. But, you know, if you can't find that to get Henwin to the fairy folk, or the whatever yeah, he is. fair folk. <coughs> what banner of creature is this wandering nearby? Is it Doby? It is. I'm Gurgi. Oh, Gurgi, yes. Do you have any is. munchings and crunchings? Ouch. I forgot Gurgi. He stole something. He hurt us. He always steals things. Here, take my apple. Thank you for tasty apple, kind master. Gurgi, now Terran's friend for life. Oh, uh, until he dies. Oh, wait. And then he comes back to life. Or does he? Because it's Disney. <laughs> Uh-oh, our throat is dry. Does we are parched. We're dying? Dying. Dying. Children are dying. Oh, oh, oh. Better drink our water. <laughs> the water from your flask tastes delicious. How much more water do we have? I think it's like three or four fills. It's kind of like the water flask in like Quest for Glory. We're back home. We've done it. Yeah. Game's over. It's just as short as the fairy tale. Did we do everything we needed to do? No. We have to stop the the horned king. The horny king. He was really... He has some big horns. He was really into the dead. Mm-hmm. Really. <laughs> really. Into, hey, there's a wall. This bridge marks the boundary of whatever Dalvin. <laughs> Your feet are wet from walking through the shallow stream. 
Oh. Uh, there is a wallet beneath the bridge. Ha! I don't know if that's... Reaching under the footbridge, you take the wallet and look inside. It is filled with food. What? Yes, there is a wallet filled with food. I don't know if that's canon. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what manner of creature is this wandering by? It's Gurgi! Hello, Brave Master. Gurgi's still Terran's friend for life. <laughs> he steals something again. If he's our friend, why is he stealing from us? Oh, Look at us swim. I didn't know we could swim. <laughs> this manner of creature is... Oh, what? There he is again. I like how it's like, what manner of creature is this? We've already seen him like three times. Yes. And he's told us his name. Uh, do we have to swim up the waterfall or do we have to climb? There is a climbing part in this later that is like the uh, epitome of Satan. Well, they're notorious for their climbing. Brunsk! <laughs> you say the word exactly as Blistle taught you. The rock beside the waterfall sinks and the water thing. Do, 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 do. I like how he kind of literally like floated over that there. You enter the cave. I would not even known that was a cave. It's yeah, me either. You can hardly tell. Oh, you're falling! The fairy. That's the fairy. But they're ouch. Are the fair folk? They're fairies. Dude, dude. Doo -doo. We have lots of points. It's the king. And just here is this falling into my kingdom. King of the fair folk. The waterfall is supposed to keep people out. Damn it. We should just make up our own dialogue. <laughs> my name is Taryn. <laughs> I'm a big keeper bitch and you, you need my help because I'm a big keeper bitch and I know what I'm doing. You... Yeah, the me. great Dobbin sends me a pig keeper? Yeah, bitch. And you're a sister pig keeper? At that? I can't believe it. If well, you truly represent Dobbin... I have to work you... I have to work for a few more months to be the actual pig keeper. He's assistant. I'm assistant to the pig keeper. Uh-oh, here's a loot. Here, take this. I don't want it. It's heavy. It's making me sleepy. Now, in the game, or the actual movie, the king is like kind of like a weak... Like I'm trying to think, of, like the cat from Five Will Goes West. Type yeah, thing. he's like one of those type characters. Oh yes, it the secret tunnels, secret tunnels. Secrets. Since you last saw Dobbin, the Horn King has dispatched legions of warriors to find the Black Cauldron. If he succeeds in finding it, he'll destroy our civilization. Tarvin, I beg you, find and destroy the Black Cauldron. But I'm a pig keeper. I give you this magic mirror and enough fair folk flying dust for five somethings. <laughs> five minutes. Five minutes. Minutes. Just sprinkle the flying dust whenever you want to stop or start flying. Good luck, Darren. It's like the fairy dust from uh, King's Quest V. <laughs> a strange feeling comes over <laughs> you. Looking down, something else is looking up. Ooh. Is he Jesus Christ Superstar? <laughs> Jesus Christ Superstar! Um, do we have to say the word again? Burf! Ha ha I think we do. There is a rock blocking my path. A boom! <laughs> That's Burf. hilarious that we have to say that. But you can leave. Well, you know, it adds valuable time to the game. Disney wanted this game to be long. It's a. It's about as long as the movie. <laughs> he has such a, like, derped... Uh-oh. What manner of creature is it? <laughs> Will you stop touching me? <laughs> bad touch. Bad touch! Take my wallet of food. Leave me alone. <laughs> well, hey, we're home. We're... That's not how this works. <laughs> but yeah. all loops. We have to go see the witches, the three witches. Yes, have. we have to do the three witches, and we have to get the sword. Yes. Knapsack. Because the sword. But we're is filling what we, our water flask. We could use to kill the the cauldron or destroy the cauldron, or you could have someone go in it of their own accord, and which, that would also destroy the cauldron. Which we have somebody that could do that since we've been nice to them. Yes. The river rapids roar. That's all you need to know. <laughs> what do you mean the rapids? I don't get it. He could swim. My, <laughs> what you don't know is that he's in the Olympics, but you know, since he took steroids, he can't. Uh, 
He has to sit out like Russia. Well, this is the 80s. They're allowed these days. <laughs> oh, there's a knife. With... Why did you stab me with a knife in the face? And put a note. No trespassing. Oh. It's time to save. <laughs> save the game. Let's take that sharp dagger. You stab it directly into your jugular vein. You die a quick Should death. Should you take the paper? You have no use for the no trespassing sign. So I guess not. So we take the nice pointy dagger. Now it would be like a nerf one. Ooh, we're in more of a marsh. It's a oh, dismal. that's where the the three witches are. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. That, that tree has an O face that you just don't want to think about. What is happening? What? Well, uh, how? We don't go in the mouth. Well, based on well, other movies like The Evil Dead, I know what <laughs> trees do. They put their brambles in your vagina. Well, God. I mean, it is just rape and pillage. Well, we're getting close to uh, one of the really bad... This is not fun either because you have to go around the rocks like that, the trees to get exactly oh, where you I want. Oh, I wouldn't have ever known. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. How horrible. <clears throat> just wait. The worst part's coming up. <laughs> Oh, it's not. It's not. You, you made, made it. it. Thank Jesus. Yep. Oh, no. You walked right into the wall. Pfft, ow. Ow. Oh, we're getting hungry. We will die. For munchies and crunchies? <laughs> Let's eat our bread. Dobbin's bread tastes delicious. Save and restore. Mm. Why are we saving before climbing? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh oh. <laughs> Miss. There we go. <laughs> okay. You grab the rope and hang on tight. Don't look down. Oh no! Dead. Oh, good lord. Is it really going to be like that? It uh, sure is. Look, we have antler ears. Oh, we kind of do. Or weird arms. Weird Al. Are we going to fly? <laughs> it missed. It didn't. Catches on a dead branch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game. Normal sp slow See, speed. See, what I get, uh, you know, is ironic about it. Is, you know, they made it easier with that system. That's it. It's all takes your dead. Oh, good gravy. Um, they made it, you know, for kids, but then you do this. Which makes it hard for kids. Because you have to really watch where his hands are. And you shouldn't have to save scum. No. And if they didn't want you to, they should have made that an option. It's like, okay, I made it another couple of feet. So, you know. Oh, no! Dead! Good thing you saved. <clears throat> no, considering I've already played through this game before and know what I'm dealing with. <laughs> He's like, ah! And looking at us like, why, God? I'm so proud of this almost reminds me of the Stair Quest game that I played. <laughs> They're notorious for that. Like, that is one thing Sierra is notorious for, is, like, the Stairs of Doom. Except in, you know, in Rosella, in her adventure, when you go to the fairy folk place and there's actually railings. Yeah. Boy, you know. But that's because they were... <laughs> I hope you didn't save in a spot where you can't move. I did that on the original one, had to start over. No one really knew because I edited it out and just made it that way, but literally I had to go back and then hope that, there we go. You successfully do this. We have to tell you this because it's that big of a deal. And it's still not over yet. This part's not fun either. <clears throat> so. Four. Burp, burp. Your fingertips clutch the rock. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Gratefully, you get there, okay? Now, this is kind of like King's Quest Three when you have to do all the climbing, which is also awful. But don't go to the wrong place, because he'll slip and fall. What's the wrong place? It doesn't let you know. He can just, like, get sweaty hands and die. 
That's horrible. <laughs> it's like, or if he's hungry, at a certain point he can get tired and let go. I do believe. One of the you know reasons you have to eat. And if you of course climb the wrong hey, you way, you some points. Yeah, because we successfully did it. <gasps> it's the castle. I'm serious. I like the graphics on this game. For what it did, yeah, you know, in the time period, these were doing amazing. And look, you know, let's make this walking into the castle ridiculous too. I don't think that's how this works. <laughs> well, you know. I think you have some water pollution problems. Well, Gurgy P. You know, all the crunchies and bunchies he had, that's what it did. There's an issue. Just a slight issue. Gurgy kind of had the shit! Shitsies and peepees! Pooped all over! Oh, please don't go in the water. And look, it's the King's Quest 1 sea monster. Except there are four of them. That's the move on in technology. We can have one. Now we can have four. Four whole sea monsters. Are we waiting for the drawbridge? You'll see. Says I. Because the movie helps me somewhat, <laughs> but not totally. Well, yeah. I mean... Seeing the movie at least made the game a little easier to uh, deal with here. This is one I don't have in box yet I'd like to get. Uh-oh. Our throat is dry. From walking around. Walking around the old castle, it's got a green lake. <laughs> I wouldn't take water from this lake, it would probably kill me. Those creatures are living fine. <laughs> But it is a Sierra game. You will die. <laughs> Roberta Williams hates us so much. Why do you kill us so much, Roberta Williams? You are so mean. You make me want to die. That's what you need is make a love song to L Roberta Williams to meet her. Uh, yeah. It goes viral. <laughs> There we go. Oh, my. Look who was right. I wasn't going to say anything because you needed to know. <laughs> derp, 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 derp. Gathering your courage, you leap into the rear of the wagon. The henchman continues into the castle. Those are dead bodies. Mm-hmm. So that he can fornicate with them. No, he puts them in the cauldron and they come back to life. Shh. No. <laughs> no fornication. <laughs> You leap from the wagon. <laughs> Look at the graphics. There's some purples, some yellers, some reds. Oh my. Let's get drunk. <laughs> Everybody get drunk tonight. You are in the Horn King's cellar. Let's see, it's all the fortifications. Hey, we got of... almost half the points. I know. Here's one of his dragon. Oh, what? Oh, oh. You, sir. Butcher. Oh, oh, no. Oh, we got caught. You were taken to a cell in the Horn King's dungeon. We probably wanted to get caught. On top of everything else, they took all of your belongings. Hope you weren't thirsty or hungry. You'll stay in this dungeon until you rot, pig boy. He almost looks like those Vikings from, like, that, cart like that comic book strip. You pick up the tin cup and carry it with you. You pocket it and place it in your purse. <laughs> you rattle the cup against the door, but nothing happens. Nothing happens. <gasps> oh. The pouch is empty. Suddenly, a flagstone slides back and a hole appears. It's the bauble thing. Yeah. I don't really... A beautiful young girl appears scolding. What's all the noise up here? Oh, hello. You must be a prince or a great warrior. No, I'm just a pig farmer. But we pretend we are. I am assistant pig keeper of Care Dalvin. I'm assistant to the pig man. <laughs> That's too bad. I was hoping for a great hero <laughs> to get me out of this dismal place. Well, I'll just have to keep looking. Oh, well. Hey, wait a minute. What's down there? Could there be a way to escape? No. <laughs> but there are many tunnels. Perhaps we could find one together. <gasps> There's nothing to do here. Leave. Let's go down the hole. Oh. We fell on top of her. 
There appears to be some caskets with some things growing out of them. Let's go look into the casket. We might find a sword somewhere. A sword in the casket. It looks like they had like an Alice in Wonderland game and they kind of just took like Alice and added a hat. <laughs> We're done. It's like, how can we make a new game without spending any money? <laughs> The bobble is a really cool addition, although it's just like a dot. <laughs> it's not even a dot, it's like a square. <laughs> well, yeah, they couldn't make circles. I know. There's a hole in the wall, dear Liza, dear Liza. When you push on the wall, a block falls forward. In other Sierra games, that would kill you. Oh, is there a dead body back there? I bet it's where the king is. And another... Another? There's a great king. A burial chamber. This must be the tomb of the great king who built this castle long ago. There's a metallic glint atop the cask. Now this movie has one of my favorite fanfare themes for trumpets. Yeah, Uh, I have the soundtrack. It's a really good fanfare. Oh, look! My bauble seems to have found another hole in the wall. Maybe I can escape. Tara, it's an old tunnel. I'm leaving this horrible place. Bye-bye. Good luck on your quest, Taryn. I'm gone.